again, everybody. Uh, today is Wednesday, and we continue our daily psalms for hope. And today we're at the Song of Ascent of Psalm 121. So get out your Bibles, and uh, let's look at uh, what they were singing as they were approaching Jerusalem or walking up the steps of the temple. Here's what it says, Psalm 121. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where does my help come? My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. He will not let your foot be moved. He who keeps you will not slumber. Behold, he who keeps Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade on your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all evil. He will keep your life. The Lord will keep your going out and your coming in from this time forth and forevermore. Well, this is, this is, uh, this is an outstanding uh, psalm. I use this a lot uh, when, uh, with people uh, who are nearing life's end uh, to just let them know that the Lord is with them. But it can also be a, a wonderful psalm when you're overwhelmed. Um, any of you feeling overwhelmed lately? Um, this is a perfect song to recite uh, when we're feeling overwhelmed, when life sort of has us uh, by the belt and just kind of is dragging us along. Uh, and uh, what, a, what a wonderful way. Uh, to kind of look at, at, at things. Uh, because typically when we're overwhelmed or when we're uh, in that state of mind, uh, our tendency is for our eyes to keep looking at that situation and dwelling on it, letting it, uh, letting it eat us from the inside out and letting it get to us in terms of sleepless nights and, and, and just overall anxiety. Um, but the, the psalmist is saying, uh, that's not where I'm going to look. Uh, when I'm overwhelmed, I'm going to be looking in a different spot. I'm not going to be looking at what overwhelms me. I'm going to be looking at who can get me through the overwhelming situation. And uh, that's the first part of this. I lift up my eyes to the hills. I lift up my eyes. It's not looking at the situation, it's looking to the Lord in that situation. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, and he is the keeper of our lives. He is the, he is the one who is before us and, and uh, in us and in the present, but also, uh, you know, a part of what is going to be happening to us in the future. And uh, to know that this God uh, is, is there all the time and understands everything that we're going through. There's no moment of sleep. There's no moment of, of slumber. There's no moment where his eyes aren't, aren't attentive to us, which is a, a fascinating part of God, that uh, just pondering that alone uh, can 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 make us in wonder of this this God that that, that we serve. Um, but if today is one of those days where there is an overwhelming uh, sense of of junk uh, that that you are facing, um, get your eyes off of that situation and look to where the psalmist is looking. I lift up my eyes to the hills. Where does my help come from? Well, my help comes from the Lord. And he, will, he is with me, he is my keeper, and he will be in, in every part of my life. And that's where we look uh, when we're overwhelmed. That's where we look uh, when we're feeling despair uh, and when life's got us down. So I hope that helps today. Uh, it's a good midweek psalm, actually, um, and one that is worthy of, of just reciting 
uh, even memorizing, uh, if you can do that, because this is this is uh, it's just a, a great way to remind ourselves that he's got he's in control, and when we feel overwhelmed, we can turn to him and find rest and refuge in him. So may God's blessings be upon you this day and be a blessing whenever and wherever you can.